Yeah? I was like humming it in my head. I was like, I've only seen this once. What's happening to me? Like, yeah. I know. They're catchy. How do they do it? I don't know. I I love this. Good look. We're good. All right, here we are. Here we are. Are you, are you okay? You look a little nervous. I was, I was just like, doing a pose with the camera. <laughs> I mean, you're a model. You look yeah. like you're walking a runway right well, here. This blue you. runway we have. The blue going. runway, yes. yes. Um, what was it like coming back to this franchise, welcoming new people in, and getting to just play again? It felt like it was right. It felt like that's where I was meant to be in that moment doing that thing. It, it felt like I'd known, you know, Terry. Um, Matt and Kira my whole life. It felt like I had done five movies with them previously. Uh, and you know, making the movie is such a special, special thing. Uh, how many people in the world get to say that they're a part of something like this? I count my lucky stars every day. The movie's amazing and I can't wait for everybody to see it. What was your favorite part of this movie particularly? I think having the aliens come in. Terry is one of my favorite people and the entire one of my best, best, best friends. And I love them so much. And like zombies not only brings other people together, but has brought me together with one of my best friends, and so um, I'm really thankful for it. Until you met on the movie, you didn't know them. Terry and I met on the movie, and okay, we actually got amazing. to live together during Zombies for a while. We were stuck together, for and we just became like separable. Yeah. I, I didn't think you could top We Own the Night with the werewolves, but like you did it this time. Did it. Um, you guys are doing all kinds of fun stuff. It's way more physical. What was it like when you saw the choreography for that number and what you were going to get? Awe inspiring. Draco and the whole, and Taya and Alicia, the whole choreography team put their hearts and souls into this movie and every day when we would show up to rehearsal they would give 100% whether it was come on out alien invasion any of the other numbers they wanted to make this movie they wanted to make it as good as possible and they did oh being a werewolf is really the best thing in the entire world and for me like I've always been a little bit shy like scared to do anything and becoming aware of getting to play these really larger than life big colorful characters has brought me out of my shell it's so much fun Tough is it to sing with those bang teeth in? Um, you know, on set, a little more challenging than in the studio because I don't have them on in the studio. But you have to pretend like you're singing. I on certainly, set, right? I certainly do. You know, actually, I did bring my my teeth into the studio one day. I can't remember what song is for. I, it might have been for We Own the Night, actually. Um, but but you know, it's definitely definitely challenging. I have to say, the first table read on Zombies 2, I sounded like this, and it was very weird. But uh, we evolved from there. It's funny because they Pierce and Chandler, I think, struggled more because they couldn't have a lisp. And what I did was instead, I was like, they kind of give you a little bit of a lisp, a little bit, and I. I kind of embraced that and I was like, I'm just gonna use that in my character and now Winter sometimes has a little bit of a laugh. <laughs> because Winter is just such a fun character. Oh, she's fun. She's so much fun. Playing her is the best thing in the entire world because you just kind of get to go on set and play and have fun and I can try a ton of different things. Um, she's really expressive so I get the chance to just be over the top every single day. Zombies has such a great fan base. Any message you want to send to them? <laughs> I hope that whatever this movie brings to you, it brings to you with love. I'll see you there. They're here to take what's ours.